Welcome to the rewarding world of flying with the Garmin GTN 750 and GTN 650. Either one of these wonderful systems will enhance your situational awareness and reduce your workload better than any other navigation system that has come before. And our goal is that when you get done with this course, you'll be able to operate both the 750 and 650 and take advantage of what they can do for you. Your GTN will be a big help in your most important job as a pilot, risk management. Now the reason the GTNs are so good at making our lives easier is built right into the name. GTN stands for Garmin Touchscreen Navigator. The touchscreen means that you don't have to use knobs and remember which knob to use and which way to turn it. The GTN just shows you your choices on the home screen and all you have to do is touch the choice that takes you where you want to go. It's faster, more intuitive, and a lot more fun. Now at the core, the GTNs are GPSs with large databases and built-in Navcom radios. And a great advantage of both the GTN 750 and 650 is that they utilize WASP GPS, which means you can fly RNAV approaches with ILS-like precision at thousands of airports across the country. Now even though the GTNs give you a touchscreen interface, there are one, two, and three knobs and one, two physical keys on each one of them. Now as we go along, you'll see that you hardly ever have to touch the knobs unless you want to, and you probably won't want to. And now I have to tell you, when I first heard that the GTNs were touchscreen, Oh, I was skeptical. I thought, how about turbulence? Well, Garmin put bezels to the left and right of both units. And so I steady my hand on the bezel and I find the turbulence is not a problem using the touchscreen. Now, some pages have a scroll bar like this one right here that tells you where you are on the page. So you just touch the arrow keys or you can just scroll and to scroll, you can do it by touching the screen and dragging it along with your finger. And you don't have to hit this little skinny scroll bar, just drag anything on the screen up or down. Now the home key is at the upper right of each one of these units on both the GTN 650 and 750. The and what you have to do, an easy way to get started on something, is to press the home key and it'll take you to this home page. And one of the smart things about the home page and the Garmin design is that most of the functions or pages that you want to use in flight are right here. Now if you're in flight and you don't see what you're looking for on this home page, the odds are you'll find it by pressing the utilities page right here. Now let's look again at the GTN 750 and touch the flight plan key to go to the active flight plan page. Now I want to show you these keys along the bottom of this page down here in the gray area and these are called touchscreen keys. Now the number and purpose of touchscreen keys varies on every page. For instance, in this case you see a menu key and you might think touching the menu key will take you back to the home page. Well, it doesn't to get back to the home page. You press the home key along the bezel. Now on individual pages, the menu key takes you to the menu for that page. For instance, Touching the menu key on the flight plan page takes you to a menu of items for your flight plan. Now anytime you're on a page and want to go back to the previous page, you just simply touch the back key. Now every GTN page except the home page has a back key. The GTN 650 pages also have, by the way, these touchscreen keys. and They're generally on the left or right sides of the display. Here we're looking at the map page on the GTN 650 and you see there's a menu key on the left and, and a back key on the left and, and on the lower right there are in and out keys. Now touchscreen keys are tailored to each page to make it as clear and as easy to use as possible. Now, you and I will go through specifics of touchscreen keys on each page as we discuss that page in detail. Now one thing you are probably going to want to do a lot 
is fly direct to something. Well, the only key on the bezel besides the home key is the direct to key. On both the GTN 650 and 750, they're to the right of the screen, and the direct to key is this key right here with the letter D and the arrow symbol. You press it to go to the direct to page.